it was April uh, of, of 2020 when we actually shifted into uh, into a live environment in the Open Edge 12 as OE running on Red Hat. And uh, that process actually showcased a few things that we had not uh, planned for before. And what that was is how uh, security played a role, more importantly, how memory played a role. And it became very evident that the old way of how code ran on the old classic app servers was definitely not going to be the same way it ran in, the, in this. So it was a bit of a stumble and fall, but pick yourself up. And then that caused a new plan to get created in um, what we call that as the application stabilization, which is where we are. We're probably close to the 80%. And it was reviewing applications, review, uh, reviewing how code was written, not necessarily the engine in itself, but really how code written all the way from the early 90s was now going to be reflective in how it ran, how it was supported in the in the runtime environments. And that showed us, thanks to OE management, a lot of memory, a lot of CPU spikes that we would have to understand how to handle. All that became part and parcel of the stabilization program, which I can say right now is behind us, probably around 80% of it. And we've now still got the remaining 20% to go, but it's that's been our journey. We run a shop that is uh, running off single sign-on on all our applications through an, a, a cloud-based IDP. We use Octa. Uh, most of our applications, most of our cloud apps, most of our on-prem apps that are built on the cloud all leverage that functionality. Using tend to be that was a limitation. We could not communicate it because fundamentally we could not talk HTTP. That has changed and that has dramatically changed the whole aspect of all our pro progress applications written in Open Edge now because we've now created a layer of authentication using the, the client principal object in the C and what we call the CPO internally um, to basically be the platform of authentication. And over that, any application module that we would end up adding on just rides on that security and authentication model. So to us, that has been one of the biggest advantages